I made a big decision. And then I explored the Kadiawan village in Davao City, which features the 11 indigenous and Moro tribes and their way of life. Ah, you win! <laughs> you win! Ah. <laughs> How many points? Four points? We have to get, oh, we have to get four. 20 points. 20 points? Oh, it'll be a very long game. So, let me tell you a little story. I've had this pickup now, this Hilux, for almost five years. In that time, I've driven 175,000 kilometers on it, and it's served me very, very, very well. However, when I was doing my business before, yes, very, very useful. And I've come to the stage of thinking, first, number one, do I need a pickup? Well, does anyone need it? But more to the point, do I need to use it for every journey? And my answer to that, to be honest, is no. I mean, this is this is costly to run, especially now diesel's so expensive. And also, more to the point, it doesn't really give you the same experience where you're on a motorbike, you experience everything around you. You're in here, you're in your little box, safe from the world. But yeah, so I've decided to go and um, buy a motorbike. We've been talking about this for a while, <laughs> thinking about it myself for a while, and I'm gonna get a motorbike and, and then set it up somehow for touring. I still use this sometimes. I'm gonna really shift how I travel. This is getting a bit, uh... <laughs> Hey, we're going to have fun. What's that? Okay, rock it, are you? Siggy? Siggy, we're going to have fun. Hey, This is uh, Noel, by the way, old friend of mine. Hello. Hello. Hello, welcome to Mother Earth Corporation. Hello. Gana, Gana, and go on, no? I feel like a Kamoti Motors Club. Well, good enough. <laughs> Kamoti Riders Club, new member. I thought long and hard about this, and I want a manual. I want manual. I'm bored of automatics. I want a manual, so the sniper seemed pretty good. The Yamaha Sniper, 155ccs of power. A good starter bike. Okay, there. And one thing is mandatory testing. I'd luck go. <laughs> <It's a horn. laughs> okay, that's the eye. Feel the switch. I feel switch. We did a demo. Oh, high beam. High beam. Low beam. Low beam. Low beam. Low beam. Low beam. Passing light. Oh, I'm going to get a truck. Oh, zero. Oh, zero. 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 <laughs> How much that? Brava guy, you are. I'm ping, I'm ping. Oh, look at it. So, go on, come on, get here. Ay, ow. No. Put your nose in. Come on, nose in. Good boy. I've got the perfect key ring for this. No one's going to mess with me. The difficulty is it's going to take, he told me two to three months to get the registration sorted. They need to get a paper, bit of paperwork from outside. It has to go to the LTO, but the LTO takes about one week, he said. The longest is getting a CSR, CSR, Certificate of Sales Registration. So I've got to use this for a little while longer. So maybe in October, I can use it. We'll see. I was going to make some little contest to name this, and then I realised that, well, between me and Kulas, we worked it out. I wanted it to be called Commander Datog, because when I started out, people kept saying, change your name to Datog, it's good luck, it's good luck. And then I said, that's not how it works. That's not how it works, I'm Datot, Datot go Datan, and actually the biggest luck I've ever had in my life, so. But I thought, then Kulas came up with the name, he said, no, Commander Datog, that's weird. So we came up and said, call it Da Oggy. And I thought that's the best thing I've ever heard in my life. Well, maybe not the best thing in my life, but it's pretty good. Commander Da Ot and Da Oggy. Da Oggy. To represent my. how I'm winning those battles. And Da Oggy. Just to, for success. 
it's it represents the battles that you fight and win. But you can still be that hot. The rider can be that hot. Just got to be careful. Kariawan is a time to exhibit the 11 indigenous and Moro tribes that are part of the makeup of Davao. So I took a visit to this purpose-built village with Billy. Hello, sir. Hello, how are ya? Good morning. Good to see ya. <laughs> <laughs> and there's something really cool here I've never seen before, and I don't know if you have, but the biggest banana in the Philippines is here. I haven't seen that. The Tausug, people of the current, are from the Sulu archipelago and are one of the largest Muslim ethnic groups in the Philippines. It's used many warriors, but we're not a war freak or something, but we are friendly uh -huh. and we do keep our promises as well. A strong warrior race yes. that's friendly though. <laughs> yes. Yes, 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 exactly. <laughs> it is composed of uh, many beads. They are, it depends on the uh, person who'd like to wear that thing. It's either brass or made of bronze or if it's a royal blood, you can uh, put a gold beads on it. That's what it's called uh, tambuku. Is that the, the tattoo? Uh, that's our Sultan. Yeah. Yes. Sultan, of yeah. course, yeah, Tausug, yeah, yeah, of course. Sultan, Sultan of the Sulu. <laughs> Tausug culture is very deep, historical, and vibrant. And there's lots of examples of this here. Composed of geometrical designs, usually diamond, as you can see here. So this is the big symbol for our tribe. It is usually uh, where it's a headpiece. So as long as you're a Tausug, or even if you're not, many people are, like to wear this thing. Uh, how is it made? Uh, uh, it's through weave, a traditional weaving method. Mm -hmm. Oh, just about. <laughs> <laughs> it's big man in a little coat. <laughs> there you go. Uh, I'm not sure if the, it will, if this one's been sent you. <laughs> one leg from the side. Oh, we just go like this. We just go like this. Okay. This oh is, yeah, this there is you how go. It looks. This is how it looks. This is it. Well, this uh, sure, is, I, maybe, maybe. this one you should be aware of. Maybe. No, it'll fit, it'll fit. I like wearing this. I, I know, I know immediate. No, these will fit, these will fit. Yeah, yeah. This is cool. And it's felty. <laughs> felty, that's it's felty. a new word. It's nice. The Tausug's really got a big history, all the way back to the Sultan of the Sulu days, so hundreds and hundreds of years old. The Maguindanaunons are also descendants of a centuries-old Sultanate, with an equally rich culture. Yes, I have to learn the Saya. Yeah, yeah, I got yeah, a lot yeah. too if I'm going to hang out with you. Oh, I can't interpret it. Oh, 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 can't I? Oh, yeah. Again, the Maguindanaun tribe, very colourful. And we have these, again, a lot of this is on ceremony and festivity. So we have the foods and the cooking and so on for the datus. This is what this is. And we also have the gongs in a different design style. Again, there's similarities, but there's also differences. But what I love is the vibrancy and the color and the diversity and the expression. It's really something special. And I'm, I'm glad that this is here every year. I know it's about to go on the car. Do we in a pot? Durian. It's a tear and I'm going to do it. Should I? Yeah, you, you should try, you should try okay. durian. Okay, it's uh, my first time. First time durian? Yeah, yeah. Uh, no durian for now. We're just going to try some of the Maguindanao and native snacks. We have the most important question of all, which is what do we try? Yeah. I mean, what do we try? Uh, this is uh, Ipanganes. Uh, they're, they're calling it Putri Mandi. Commander Dao does, but I do have a tongue for tasting. Yeah, I think it's a good idea. Yeah, yeah. 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 Putri Mandi, Mandi, Putri Mandi. Yeah. Alright, here we go. Cheers. Oh, well. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm sorry. What's the other one? Uh, I need to do a little bit. Oi. One. Apple Vavon. Apple Vavon. Okay, okay, okay. Dudol, dudol, uh, dudol, ah. That is mulwa. La mica, I want dudol. A bulwa. Okay, we can cheers this one because I remembered. Cheers! cheers. <laughs> <laughs> mm, that tastes yeah. like a roasted flavor. Mm. 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 Yep, yep, you, you're, you're doing it better than me. Mm. Mm. Oh, I was. <laughs> mm. 
from once you start chewing it, more flavor comes out. I forgot how this is made. That's really, really good. Yeah, I like that. The Maguindanaoans' neighbors, geographically too, are the Iranuns. And their house has an attic room for the princess. Welcome to the Iran Torogan. Iran, thank you, thank you. Indigenous warrior look. Come on. There you go. Doesn't work. <laughs> Very cool. <laughs> oh. oh, yes. Okay. It's ever since I started traveling down into Maguindanao and Zambonga Peninsula. I, I love swords. They're awesome. Very, very, very cool. There's so much colour, you know? So much colour in life. The Irvinons. What? Parang, no? Parang, yeah, Parang. We're going to now, yeah, yeah. Okay, let's do what? So we're in it. <laughs> My monarch's falling. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, it's so much cooler. It's warm in those, but they're so beautifully made. We are the natives of Dabo that embrace Islam. So we are really from here. Among these six tribes, the Moros, we are from Dabo, originated from Dabo. From Banay Banay to or Del Sur. So we promote peace here because from among East Moros and the Lumax, we, we understand each other, we respect each other. So we are correcting the uh, wrong perceptions of um, uh, other people. See? Very good, very good. No, that's so important. Yeah. It's so, so important. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Because we receive and we know we have a lot of wrong percep perceptions of other regions, of other people, not only locally, not only domestic, but globally. So this is a sample. A good lesson for the rest of the yes. world. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah how live peacefully yeah. together, you know? We, yeah. we are still peaceful here. I am respecting you, you are respecting so we respect each other, there's peace. We are peace. We are promoting peace. Because oh, you know your culture is so colorful, your culture. Like, yeah, really, really because we are happy culture. people. It means... Yeah, this is the expression of yourself. Yeah, the right? expressions of ourselves. You, you understand, you can address this color to people. That we are happy, we are peace-loving people. We are very hospitable. Thank you, thank you so much. Yeah, thank you. Welcome to Kadayawan Festival and welcome here in Kadayawan Tribal Village. So the Sama tribe, I've, I've been to see them in Baziland and they have a fantastic history on the ocean as well. They often live above the water, which I think, yes, that's how this house is built, on stilts. The intricacies of this design, life on the ocean, as an art form. So as you go around, you start to notice there, there were some similarities, but they're very unique in the exact designs. They're very unique and very special to, to the tribes. Sama, above water. And again, just so much beautiful heritage. Oh, yes, that's a good color view. Fit and stretch it around your neck. Next, you know, first. Yeah, okay. it works. It works. And there. Okay. Here we go. We're jamming. Yeah. One, two, three. I got some talent. 
I think there's only one more of the Moro tribes remain that we haven't been to, which is the Maranao, which is a very, they have a lot of history. Look here. That's a Maranao pattern in woodcraft. It's just a creativity of a nose, mixing of colors because Maranao are known for its vibrant colors. The people of the lake, Lake Lanao, are the Maranaos. with a big gong here. Um, <laughs> so these are the six Moro tribes of Davao City and there's five Lumad tribes on the other side. So we'll go over to see them now and I love the Discarte. Discarte is the best. <laughs> it suits you. Really? I look like the, the Chinese one who wears it. <laughs> the panache of a... Uh, no, never mind. The five indigenous tribes of Davao City are settled on the mountain slopes that surround the city. The Bagobo Tagabawa are from the southern slopes of Mount Apo, the Obo Manobo from Baguio District, and the Matic Salug from Buda. I'm back. It's a big as I can go on. The Atta. The final of the 11 tribes that I've visited here. And very, very, very unique in the materials, the art, and everything else. Okay, it's not the last. There's one more. I don't know the name yet. I'll tell you in a sec. Bagobo Clatter. I can read. <laughs> ah, okay, there's another one. No. Yeah. Yeah. yeah! Okay, shoe. 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 <laughs> How many points? Four points? We have to get Oh, we have to get four. 20 points. 20 points? Oh, it'll be a very long game. Okay. Yeah, 20 points. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna... Okay, okay. You ready? Yeah! 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 yeah. yeah. You got me! <laughs> yeah, you're very good at this. What's your name? Champy. Champy. Yeah, Champy. Like champion. Yes, and nice I, to meet you. I said this like swords. Yeah. And this is our soft swords, right? This didn't hurt you. Oh, these are soft swords. Oh, yes, yes, yes. See? Yeah, these are good. They cannot kill you. No. They can't hurt me. Ah, you are the champion. Yeah, your shirt says champion. <laughs> your shirt champion. Oh, you want to you want to borrow my camera? Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. I'm the winner! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I lost the game. No. Yeah, they, he's making a I movie empty. too. Yes, he's making a movie. Congratulations, <laughs> champion. Congratulations. Now you can go now so you can leave. Yes. Also celebrating the native culture of Davao City is a nearby restaurant called Barak Bukid, run by Chef Pau. into the kitchen. I'm allowed. Service please. Two waters to table five. I want to steal all of your knowledge about cooking. Okay. <laughs> Not really. So your entire life story. No. This place, before before we build up this uh, restaurant here in downtown, we started in Kalinan. So we have a farm there. So my sister has a farm. She's the one who's practicing the 
natural farming way of uh, growing up vegetables and livestock. My other sister, she's the artist. And me, I'm the chef. We, we group up together, then uh, all the supplies coming from the farm. It's mine. That's you. And it's all, <laughs> it's all like local yeah, healthy but, but, ingredients. But, but, but we, we, as much as possible, we practice the traditional way of cooking. Filipino. So we don't serve any... It comes, yeah, comes with chemicals or like sodas and everything. No. So we bawal, all, bawal magic bawal, soba. Yes. Bawal, bawal MSGs. <laughs> so we don't use MSGs here. This is so awesome. All natural. So mm. all on the spot cooking. Oh, nilagang baka. Okay, let's let's. You taste the vegetables. Yeah. So the I love nilaga, your vegetables. Actually, the, the nilaga is one of the traditional in Luzon. Mm. Meat so tender. Yeah. Okay. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, that bit. That's second t-shirt. <laughs> Muscle shirt. It's awesome meeting you. It was great to meet you too again. I uh, look forward to more adventures in the future, yeah? Wanagi and me. That's his YouTube. Go check him out. Hopefully he comments in time and I can pin it. Yeah, yeah. Clear that I don't miss it. Yeah, it's gonna happen. Yeah, yeah, and Wanagi's outside. Make sure you say goodbye to her. Bye, Wanagi. Bye-bye. Good dog. Oh, wait. I'll make, I, I'm gonna make the sign closed. I'm gonna close your restaurant. Huh? Hold it here. I'll hold it here. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh! What have I done wrong? Ah, stuck. Oh, very dark. Oh, hey, okay, like that. There we go. Closed. Okay, I've closed your restaurant. Is that okay? <laughs> no problem. I'm like Iowa. Okay. Next time, will it? Next time. Ah, oh, I'm big. I'm big. I'll oh, see you in Kapil. Yes, yes. <laughs> see you there, Baganga. Tiny compared to me. This is going to be cool. I have to break this in driving around the subdivision, private roads. I'll be doing that in proper gear. All I'm going to do next is at the back, I'm just going to put like a box and then side bags, 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 eye bags. It's going to be fun. Glad you didn't mention me. Ah? Huh? <laughs> I have eye bags. Darker than me. Still look beautiful. <laughs>